A robber learns an Ackworth Subway restaurant is not an easy mark when the clerk pulls out a gun and shoots him. It happened at the restaurant off Ackworth Oaks Drive. The bullet hit the suspect and doctors rushed him into surgery. A Fox News Portia Bruner followed that story since the beginning and joins us now with the latest. Portia? Yeah, Russ, I can tell you no comment from the employees here at the subway. They have been told not to talk. We do know police are looking at the video from inside. But I can tell you the customers that we've met this afternoon, no sympathy for the young man who went inside with a gun and ended up being shot once in the chest. Police tell Fox 5 there were no customers inside this Ackworth Subway restaurant when an armed robber ran through the front door and ambushed two employees around 1045 Monday morning. The suspect uh, entered the store, uh, jumped over the counter and produced a firearm and an employee was able to uh, get their firearm first and fire one shot at the suspect, striking him in the chest. Police Captain Mark Cheatham says the wounded would-be robber ended up at this medical facility a few miles away after witnesses say he was spotted getting into a gray or silver vehicle. Few, Did they chase him? Uh, no, there was no chase. After the gunshot, uh, the suspect fled on foot. And uh, just a few moments later, we get a call from Kennesaw advising us that they're responding to a person shot at an urgent care. The store reopened shortly after police cleared the scene. Investigators are now reviewing security video from inside the store and other locations to get a better sense of who helped the wounded robber get away. The perp still listed in critical condition. Police have not charged the male clerk. From all accounts at this point, the, um, the clerk inside the store uh, appears to be defending themselves. Uh, any person that comes in to rob a place and has a weapon of any type, I think the employee did the right thing. Okay, so at this point, Ackworth police are not releasing the name of the man who is in the hospital. They say they do know who he is, uh, and he had surgery all day, but they're not releasing his name or his charges, that is, if he survives. Uh, police are also looking for information from the public about who it was who dropped him off at that medical clinic. Reporting live in Ackworth, Portia Bruner, Fox 5 News. Portia, thank you.